Guys, this is Mr. Joshy J, and this is your match review of Manchester United versus Atalanta in the Champions League. Wow, my goodness me, what an unbelievable turnaround by Manchester United. One of them famous European nights at Old Trafford, where we were 2 0 down to Atalanta, but we came back to win 3 2. It is an absolute disastrous start, you know. I believe the starting line <clears throat> excuse me, I believe the starting lineup in the first half was totally wrong, you know, the team selection and that because we were not good in the first half at all. We are absolutely fucking horseshit. Manchester United were. I mean we went one nil down, you know, terrible defending. Both goals, again, terrible defending. I can't wait until Raphael Varane is fit again because Lindelof is shit. I'm sorry. He is so slow. One positive thing I can say about Lindelof, though, sometimes he's good at making forward passes. Well, if he's good at doing that, maybe he should be in the midfield instead of defence. Maybe he'd be more useful in the midfield, but... A defender, he's absolutely horse shit. So I can't wait for Raphael Moran to be fit again. Fred, just your half time, it's an absolute sitter. What the actual fuck was that, Fred? You should have put that in the net, mate. Dear me, that was terrible bit of play by Fred. That really, really was. And then just your half time, Marcus Rashford with another chance. I mean, we had two great chances for half time, so easily could have been 2 2. But then in the second half, thankfully, Marcus Rashford gives us one goal back very early on in the second half. And then, guess who scores the equaliser? Harry Maguire. It wasn't even a header, it's like a forward strike. It was absolutely a phenomenal finish. Well, well done, lads. That's absolutely superb by Harry Maguire. That really was. Yes. Get in. 2-2. And then who else with the winner? Cristiano Ronaldo made it 3-2. And just like that, Manchester United in that game went from being bottom of the group to top of the group. It's mad. Because it looked like... We're going to end the evening bottom of the group in huge danger of going out. Now, instead, now, with that win against Atalanta, we put ourselves in a really strong position of qualifying for the next round of the Champions League. Now, am I still on the out after this game? Of course I am. You know, it's like, I still think he's nowhere near good enough to be Manchester United manager. I still got a feeling Liverpool will tear our defence apart on Sunday. I really do. It's a great comeback by the lads. The players Liverpool got were in massive trouble, I reckon. Because, like I said, the defending in the first half against Atalanta last night was absolutely atrocious. It really was absolutely atrocious. The sooner we sort that out, the better. I just cannot wait, as I said, for Raphael Moran to get back in the starting lineup, because we're definitely missing him. But thankfully, Maguire, I wouldn't say he had the best of games again last night, but that was a really good finish. But the way we saw out in the game against Atalanta after we got the third goal, we did quite well defending after that, so I will give the team credit for that. But Fred's missing that chance. It just sums him up how really he's not good enough to be a Manchester United player, is he? Because missing that chance is absolutely criminal, in my opinion. So Fred, nowhere near good enough. But I'm just happy we made the comeback. Because if we lost that, we would have been in massive trouble and in danger of going out in the Champions League. I mean, it will be hard when we face Atalanta again in a couple of weeks' time. At their stadium, because I think they're quite good at home at Atlanta, so we really must be on top of our game for that one. But by winning that match last night against them, we put ourselves in a much better position to qualify for the next stage now. Comment your thoughts down below, I will always reply. 
It didn't get to watch the game live, obviously, because it's on BT Sorts, but I watched the highlights on the BT Sorts YouTube channel. Oh, Ronaldo's header, world's class. Yes. Bye-bye.